Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So, as you can see, I've been playing the makeup, trying to try some different things, kind of motivate, wake myself up. Um, I know in a couple of my first videos, I said that I don't wear makeup and I've never really worn makeup, um, which I haven't. I've worn like eyeshadow, um, mascara, and then lip gloss, but kind of feeling it. Been <laughs> watching a lot of YouTube videos. I love watching what's in my bag videos, what's in my planner bag, what's in my overnight bag, weekend bag, of course, as well as, you know, sticker hauls, plan with me, all that good stuff. And I've noticed, of course, that in everybody's bag, there's a cosmetic pouch or a lip gloss pouch or a lippy pouch. And I normally fast forward through most of that stuff um, and just kind of get to the good stuff. I'm like addicted to knowing what your catch-all pouch is and what your wallet is. I don't know why, but those are like my faves. Um, and so I normally fast forward to that part, but there's been a couple videos I've been like, oh, that's a really cute pouch. Let me see what's in there. And I've just been kind of watching and I'm like, hmm, bestie wears makeup. My sister wears makeup, but not every day, not all the time. A um, couple of my friends wear it sometimes, but I was like, I'm like the only one who does it. Maybe I should just try to see if I like it. So I don't know. Curious bug bit me. And so I decided to try it. So anywho, put on a full face today. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm um, just kind of bought a few things, trying a few things. So sometimes I think it looks great. Sometimes I think it looks weird. Um, also notice it looks very different in different lights. So trying to figure out how you know which light to do your makeup in so that you look cute. But um, I hope y'all like it. If you don't, it's okay. Please comment down below. I'm open to constructive criticism. Need to learn how to do it. So help us sister out. Um, so not only was I bit by the, I want to try some makeup bug. I was also bit by the coach bug. So if y'all saw my little 18 second video, I had honestly just got home from having a girls night out with Bestie and um, we just kind of went to a comedy show. Um, just, you know, something real small, not anything huge or major or anything. We got to see Bill Bellamy, super, super funny. I've always loved him. He's hilarious in person. He was cracking me the hell up. This man said, he don't want to whop. He don't want to whop because he ain't trying to get caught up. But anywho, um, this was a bag that I carried. I thought it was a perfect like date night, girls night out bag. Something super compact. If you're not familiar with it, this is the Coach Claire um, crossbody bag. And it does come in this kind of cream color that Coach calls it chalk. Um, it comes in the tan, which is called taupe. And then it comes in the black. Um, I got black as well because I wanted like a nice date night bag. And then I got this kind of cream color because I wanted to be able to have something if I want to wear tans or browns or mauves or something like that. I think the black is kind allowed and I thought this would go with it better um, so I did get both of them and then I also got like the matching card holder um, to go with both and so I'll show you that because um, I do have the cream one inside and so anywho this is what I used it's called the coach Claire crossbody is k-l-a-r-e um, 171 yeah, $171, if I'm not mistaken, y'all bear with me. I, I'm not going to lie. When I tell y'all I've been bit by the coach bug, I mean bit, like bought a couple bags, bit. Bought a couple wallets, bit. Um, way cheaper than Louis Vuitton, of course, but Coach was my first love. Coach was the very first brand that I was able to afford um, as far as a brand brand and not just like a Walmart or a Payless or Amazon type bag. And so I did have quite a few Coach bags as well as like Kate Spade um, and Michael Kors. And I still have a couple of them. I still kept like most of my faves, but the ones that I didn't really think I would carry anymore... Um, because I was purchasing Louis bags and other bags, I definitely kind of cleaned out the closet a little bit, but, um, I got, you know, I'm on the coach email list and I've always been, I just usually scroll past it like, eh, no, nothing really jumps out at me, but these, this and the Tilly and, um, I know I'm late to the party, but the retail coach. Parker convertible backpack also jumped out at me. So I did pick up all of those. Um, this is from the outlet. I don't mind shopping either place, retail or outlet, but a lot of the outlet bags definitely catch my eye more than retail. Sometimes retail just aren't my jam. But anyway, this is a Coach Claire. So that's K-L-A-R-E. It's $171. Um, it does come with the gold chain. It's got the leather strap on it in addition to the chain so it can be worn crossbody if you want to pull it long like this and then it can be worn as a which it also can be worn as a long shoulder bag like just on your shoulder and hit your hip um, then you can pull the chain double if you like and you can wear it as a shoulder bag which is what I did you also can take this leather part if you just really want only the chain showing you can take the leather part and tuck it on the inside of the flap and then just wear like just the chain um, as your shoulder strap which looks really elegant it has this nice gold um what do you call it tab hopefully you cannot see it's super super cute i'm sure it's going to be scratched up in a whole hot mess after some time but it's gorgeous and perfect right now um as you can see on the sides it does have two large sections this is what the bottom looks like and then on the back it has the quilt part that rolls over of course and then it has the slip pocket here this slip pocket does fit my phone i got it on the charger but i do have the um 
iPhone 10 or X, whatever. And so it fits in here the long ways just fine. This is exactly where I had it that night, so I can easily pull it in and out. But I absolutely loved, loved, loved this quilt pattern. So I just, I had to get it. I just, I just had to, y'all. I'm sorry. And it's so soft. Oh my God, it's so soft. It's so, so soft. And so, anywho, um, I posted the 18 second video. You guys wanted to see kind of what's in my bag. And so I did put a thing, few things in here. I'm not currently using this. I am currently using the um, Coach Parker convertible backpack. Um, but I did toss a few things in here that were the same items that I had that night. Um, what's missing? No, everything's in here. Everything I have that night is in here. And so it is like a magnetic um, closure. The inside is this gorgeous, gorgeous color. Oh my God, and it feels so soft. Um, but this is an overview of the inside. Nothing too, too huge. So the main things you need, a mask, hand sanitizer, AirPods, I have a piece of Simply Gilded washi tape on mine to kind of go with the fall theme. Then I have my, whoop, not close all the way, have my mints. These are the Mentos Chewy Mints, if you haven't seen one of my previous videos. And then I have, of course, Bath and Body Works Lotion. Always need that. There is a um, slip pocket here, and that night I just had um, a $20 bill in there just in case I needed cash for anything, but I don't normally carry cash. So that whole back pocket is completely empty. Love this color. And then on the other side, you have this nice divider here. So you got your second section here. This is the card holder that I use. I'm currently using the black one, and I didn't want to move my cards over just for this video. I'm just going to be honest with y'all. But um, this is the cream card holder that I used that night. It is the same quilted... I feel like maybe I should turn off some of these lights. Same quilted pattern. And it actually is, let me put this back down, y'all. It is so soft and pliable and flexible. So it's super easy to like get your cards out of the middle even when you got the sides filled. It's not like those other ones that are like super stiff. This is, oh my God, it feels so good. So anywho, you've got the middle section. So you in essence could get five cards easily just doing a single. Um, so you got the middle section here for one and then you've got two card slots um, on both sides. And so I really, really love that, that it didn't like skimp you with only giving you one on one side and two on the other. This is my first card holder. Card holder. Um, I've never really purchased card holders before. I've always just been into either a compact wallet or a full size wallet or whatever. I've never owned a card holder, but I wanted to try it out. Um, this was $29, so I did go ahead and pick up both. and. Um, I absolutely love it. Like I've been using it for two weeks straight when I do have to go to the store or go out the house or whatever. But so I've got my card holder there and that's of course the cream color. So it's called chalk. Um, it's on the website and of course it's in your local um, coach outlets if you have one near you. So then I just have the lip gloss that I'm wearing today, which is the NYX Butter Gloss Tiramisu. Love that one. And then I have a MAC lip liner. This is old or lip pencil whatever you want to call it I want to say it's plum y'all know how Mac peels off you can't read crap I think it says nightingale y'all but it's this kind of burgundy mauve color so definitely love that one then of course I have my infamous chapstick which is the baby lips I love the cherry red it does put a little light tint of red on when you don't need to wear lip gloss or don't want to you just wearing chapstick that is like my all-time favorite it's made by Maybelline and it's super moisturizing if you haven't seen it in my previous videos you definitely should check that out and then the last thing in the other pocket here is just my key so this is my Louis Vuitton 6 key holder if you haven't seen any of my other videos um, just hold all your keys I just have my car my house the, the, the gate all that good stuff and I keep my license in here um, I don't keep my license in my wallets because you honestly don't really pull your license out you pull it out if you get pulled over you pull it out if you get carded to buy some drinks or alcohol like you don't really pull it out often maybe if you're doing a return um which i don't usually do but <laughs> every now and again you do but i just like it in here this way if i want to grab and go i can grab this and go sometimes i even add like my um debit card or my credit card in here because you can put multiple cards in here um i just put it in there and grab and go and i do also have one of these in coach um but i have noticed or the coach brand i should say but i've noticed that it's a little bit bigger than this one so i do use this one more often than not um then you have this nice zippered pouch here which is empty at the moment but when 
and I used it that night, which was my first time using it since I bought it. I put my lady products in here so that it's not something that you see as soon as you open your bag. So I just had my little, you know, perfume, um, mini perfume spray that I talk about in my other videos. And then of course, you know, panty liner, wipe, what have you. Then there's this little front pocket here. I didn't have anything in here. Um, not real sure how I'm going to use that yet. You can slide your phone in here, but when the bag is closed, I didn't really like how it looked. It just didn't look really sleek because it is kind of tapered. Like it's a little bit thinner at the bottom than the top. Um, but other than that, I absolutely love this bag. You do have quite a bit of space here. You can fit quite a few things in here. So technically you have one, two, three, four pockets as well as the slip pocket here and then the slip pocket on the back. So it is a spacious bag. Um, I mean, depending on how much stuff you carry, this could be your everyday bag. It generally wouldn't be mine because I carry everything and the kitchen sink. Um, but I absolutely love this bag. I really enjoyed it. Like I said, I purchased it for going out or date night or just quick run to the store if I just want to use a crossbody and don't want to use one of my other bags, like maybe my Pouchette Matisse or what have you. But I do absolutely love this bag. I'm super happy with my purchase and glad that I got both colors. Um, so y'all for watching this video that's pretty much it just want to do a quick what's in my bag it was requested after i posted my little quick you know um video showing that you know i had the bag so definitely been bit by the coach bug i'm definitely gonna need to do like a reveal to show all the cute little bags do plan on doing that um again i've been under the weather a little bit kind of had to see the doctor get some tests done all that good stuff but i'm great i'm in good health everything's fine um i just need to you know get myself on a regular schedule with sleeping and waking up so anywho i hope you enjoyed this video if you're one of my new subscribers thank you so much i appreciate the love i'm glad you're enjoying the content so far and decided to join the family um if you're an oldie but goodie hey ladies um if this is your first time clicking on a video i hope you enjoyed it i hope you enjoy the energy and the content i post about bags what's in the bags planners um pouches wallets um good stuff and then i don't really know that i'm gonna start posting like makeup type videos uh, but if you're interested in that and you think i should add that to my lineup up, definitely let me know comment down below give me a thumbs up on this video um i'm like i said i'm new to doing it i'm new to trying it and trying to figure out where stuff goes and how to put stuff outside of mascara and lip gloss and eyeshadow so um bear with me on that if i look crazy let me know if i need to move something tweak something add something let me know let me know what your favorite brands are what i should try um so far i like what i've purchased and what i've been using so far i feel like i'm doing pretty good for a beginner um but let me know so anywho hope you enjoyed the video can't wait to see you in the next one if you've missed me i missed you as well ladies i'm super sorry i've been mia but i just been trying to get myself physically together so anywho thanks for rocking with me thanks for watching another video and i'll see y'all the next one bye